Across the country and even here in State College, runners, especially women, are being warned to be safer after the kidnapping and murder of a jogger in Tennessee. Sixty percent of women surveyed by RunnersWorld.com say they have been harassed while running, and police say we're not immune to trouble in the Happy Valley bubble. We become the third largest city in the state of Pennsylvania every home football game. Not only is Park Ave a busy road, but it also has busy sidewalks. Community members and Penn State students can be seen running alone right where I'm standing. Charlotte McAfee is a Penn State student, and when she runs, she is more aware of potential danger than ever before. So I started carrying pepper spray with me, just like in my hand like this. And I guess it just is like, it's just needed. Police say it's legal to carry pepper spray on campus, but they recommend if you carry it, be sure to test it out first. Go outside, stand up winds, and spray it. See how far it goes out. See how close this person has to get to you in order for it to be effective. Juliana Berry also has something else she can do in case someone is following her. Scream like, hey, like some guy's name, very generic, like, hey, Matt, I'm here, like, come down the hill. Other tips from police are to run with a buddy and be aware of your surroundings. Make sure to look from your left to your right and wear one earbud rather than two. Feel empowered that you can stop someone from attacking you and make sure to run to a different area or to a police station if you are being followed. In State College, I'm Isabella Leahy for the Center County Report.